Hi guys, so let's review the Gorgier Vitamin C Booster Serum. So I actually stumbled upon this skincare product online while whilst I was browsing and I saw that it promises to fade dark spots in just three days and I thought that's so amazing. And it, it says on the label that it contains 30 times vitamin C. So actually back then there was a promotion going on. So they are selling two bottles of a 30 ml vitamin C guard here for just 700 plus Philippine pesos. So I got myself two. And you know, it also says on the label that on first use the skin is smoother, brighter, and more translucent. And with regular use, the intensity, size, and numbers of dark spots are reduced. The skin looks brighter, smoother, and dark spots fade since day three. You will see 85% reduction in darkening from melanin and 30% reduction in size of spots. So I got interested into it and uh, ordered uh, two bottles. All right, so as you can see, this Garnier Vitamin C comes on this 30ml bottle. I think this is like the usual bottle of vitamin C it's a dropper form so the body is actually made up of glass so you don't want to drop this this is this is definitely going to break and you can just easily dispense it um, since it's on a dropper format i dare say that it's not as luxurious looking as the olay product but i think as compared to the olay vitamin c i like this one better just because it doesn't cost me any white heads Alright, so the Garnier Vitamin C is, it's very liquidy and very runny. It's in this liquidy opaque form. So it's kind of like water but opaque. So you can just easily apply this on your face. It's not greasy nor oily. It's not tacky unless it's humid. I did try this um, when the temperature was like really hot. And you can just feel it like it's sticky. Um, so that is a caution, especially during the summer season. So if you wear this when it's hot, you'll definitely feel it. And so I think that um, since this is just a standalone vitamin C product, it says here that it contains vitamin C as well as Japanese lemon. You definitely want to wear your moisturizer on top of this because this is going to dry your face. But as compared to the other products or other vitamin C that I've stumbled upon except for the Olay vitamin C which has niacinamide. This one is not as drying on the face. Uh, so that's a good thing. So how you use Garnier vitamin C is you first cleanse your face and then you can apply this uh, before putting on your moisturizer. Now, there's actually an expiration date indicated on the bottom of the paper covering. Um, so this one is expiring January 2025. There's also an expiration date at the back of the bottle. So as you can see here, the manufacturing date is also indicated January 2022. The expiration is January 2025. So its shelf life is about three years from the date of manufacturing um so does it really brighten the the face um with continued use it does but i'm just so disappointed of this product because it promises to fade dark spots in just three days and i expected a lot from this product just because they <laughs> indicated this on its under under promotion but unfortunately, it didn't really saw any dramatic result in three days. I don't know if it really faded that much in just that short period of time, but I did not see any dramatic result. So I'm not happy with that. Um, but overall, this is a good vitamin C product. Um, this is definitely far more cheaper as compared to Olay vitamin C. But I saw other vitamin C and stumbled upon other vitamin c products before that they are like in the 150 pesos price range but those um vitamin c serums are really drying to the face so the advantage of this 
regarding your vitamin C, it's not as drying as those. 